guys, it's Katie. So today I am really excited because I just got my first ever Ipsy bag. So um, if you guys don't know what Ipsy is, it's basically just a makeup subscription service. So it's $10 a month and every month they send you a makeup bag filled with some kind of like makeup samples and goodies based on like preferences that you set on their website. So, if you didn't know what it was, even though I'm sure you probably did, um, you should go check it out because I'm actually really excited. This is the first one I've gotten, so I'm really kind of excited to see what's in here. I kind of already know what the bag looks like, and I think I might know at least what, like, one item is in here because I have been getting some emails that told me a little bit about what's in here. So, I'm going to open this up. Um, so basically I'm just going to open this up and I'm going to show you guys what I got and then at the end of this video I'm going to be testing out some of the products, whatever's in here, on my face so you guys can kind of get my first impressions and kind of see what they look like. So don't got any makeup on right now because I'm just going to like do my makeup at the end depending what's in here. So I'm going to just open this up and show you guys what I got this month. Can we just talk about though how cute these little like packages are? Like, it's all pink and it's so pretty. I give you this little, like, card that just kind of... I guess this is the theme for November. So, it was a rock starlet. Um, on the back, they just kind of have information to go, like, go to their website. And I guess, um... They want you to, like, go online. You can see, like, tips and tricks on the products on their website. And you can also give these products some reviews. So this is what the bag looks like this month. It is, it's a really cute kind of bag. They have like, it has like constellations on it and like has some makeup designs and stuff on it. Um, has this really cute little like star and I don't know if you can see it but this is like the little zipper pool and like it says Ipsy on it. So that's, that's it's a really cute makeup bag. I need some more makeup bags so that's kind of also why I wanted to just try this out and plus I want to be able to like try out some new makeup so yeah let's open this up and see what's inside okay so the first thing I'm seeing is this so this is the Too Faced Better Than Sex mascara I've actually heard some really good things about this when it was first like released so I'm actually kind of excited to try this I have like one mascara that like is my holy grail mascara like I use the Clinique high impact mascara and I just nothing else is compared to that so I'm excited to try this out and see if um I like it better than that we'll see if I get a new uh, holy grail mascara but um this apparently has like a hourglass kind of like applicator thing so let's see I'm just gonna open this up see what it looks like so I mean it's like a nice little sample size. It just looks like this. It's really tiny. It's cute. Um, I actually had like a kind of sample size of mascara once and it actually lasted me quite a long time so that's good. I don't go through mascara much. Um, let's open this up. So that's what it looks like. This might be kind of hard to apply because it's tiny but we'll see. I will do a demo on this at the end of this video. I'm just gonna grab whatever I want out of random. So there's this. Um, this is the Ico London Skinny Liquid Eyeliner Line and Define. So this is a liquid eyeliner, a uh, felt tip pen thing I think. Um, when in doubt, wing it out. Our easy to use pen delivers precision point perfection and long lasting vinyl black color. So I actually needed a new um, felt tip eyeliner because mine is kind of drying out so I'm actually kind of excited about this. <laughs> so. I've never heard of this kind. Um, it's black, smudge proof precise, so this is what it looks like. Um, it's got a nice like, kind of, I don't know if you can see that. Got a nice little thick tip on it. Um, I'm actually like, ooh, dude, okay, this is like, like, this is really dark. It's really thick too, so I mean, but you can probably like mess with it because it's have kind of a thinned out tip. But this like drew on my hand like a freaking sharpie. Like that was it's like 
That's, 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 okay. We're gonna try this out too. Let's see what else is in this bag. This. Okay, so, um, this is Elizabeth Mott. Color is Bay Lip Looker in Moxie Mauve. So this is like, just kind of like a pinky mauve lip product. I don't know if it's like a gloss or like a liquid lipstick. Um, I don't know. I've never heard of this kind, so let's see what this is all about. Okay, so... Okay, so little applicator. Ooh, this is actually kind of really pretty. So it's like, if you can see that, it's it got like it's got like a nice sheen to it. Um, I don't know if this is like I don't know if it's like gonna be matte, dry matte or not. I think it might just be a nice little sheen, but that is like, I don't know what it'll look like on me, but that's like a really pretty like mauvey pink color. So. Yeah, I'm excited to try this out. We're going to do a nice little look with this afterwards. This thing. Okay, well, what is this? Okay, so this is the Hey Honey Good Morning Honey Silk Facial Serum. All day nourishing for all skin types. So, I have really dry skin, so maybe this will do something? I don't know. Um, I don't really use a lot of, like, face product things. I'm bad, and I just don't wash my face, and I'm gross, okay? But, um, hmm. Okay, directions. Apply daily by itself or under your day or night cream. I don't use day and night cream. Excellent when used under makeup. We're going to try that today. Uh, providing a smooth and glossy appearance to your skin. Um, I don't really know what this is, what facial serums do. I'm not, like, a big face product person. But I will try this out. Uh, can you see it? There's a bad glare. But, yeah, that's what it looks like. So, I guess we'll try this out today and see what it does. I don't really know what it's supposed to do, but whatever. So, I think there's just one more thing left in this bag. So, yeah, all empty. So, we've got Formula X nail color. So, this is a nail polish. It's so cute. Um, let's see what color it is. Okay, so it is in the color Huntress. It looks like this. It's like very hard to see. Um, I'm trying to see. Like it's like it looks like a blacky browny gold color kind of. I don't know. Um, we'll see what it looks like on my nails. I have ratchet nails, so I'm probably not gonna test this out. Oh, now like I open the bottle and it almost looks like a blue green. I'm gonna paint my nail really quick. Right, this is like a, it's like a greeny, golden, like, like, it's like, this is actually, this would be a really pretty color for, like, Christmas, sorry. I have ratchet nails, but, like, if you don't have ratchet nails, like me, then this will be a really pretty color. Let me focus in on there. Like, it's kind of like a greeny, navy, like, I don't know, it's like a, I don't, I don't know how to explain it, but it's, like, really pretty. I wish I had longer nails. I'm going to try to grow my nails out, because maybe, like, Cause this would actually be a very pretty color for like Christmas time because it like it has a really pretty like it's like a it's, a, it's really shiny like it is like in person this is like a really gorgeous color and it's like it's I don't know how to explain it but it's like a really dark dark green it is it's really pretty like I want to paint my nails this color for Christmas if I had nails <laughs> That was all that was in the Ipsy bag this month for November. So we got like five products. I'm pretty I'm pretty content because I really needed some new eyeliner and I'm excited to try this mascara. So um keep watching guys and I will be showing you guys a little uh first impression tryout of these products in one minute. Let me take this nail polish off my finger. So I just did a little bit of my makeup. Um as much as I could without the product. So I'm I'm stupid and I started putting my makeup on and I forgot about the serum stuff so um oops I'll just kind of like rub some of it on my hand to see what it's like Ooh. I did not expect it to be like yellow <laughs> um so like it made my hand really shiny 
smells really good. It smells like... It smells like vanilla -y. Um, I don't know. I mean, I'll have to try this on my face one day, but I failed. I look, I look really weird with this like red eyeshadow on and nothing else. Like, it, I'm sorry, it just looks kind of strange. But anyway, so I just put on some basic makeup. I put on just some foundation, some contouring, and I did my eye makeup and my eyebrows and stuff. So yeah, I look really weird though because I don't have like mascara on and like the lighting is very bright. But um, uh, my eyes, I am wearing. Um, I'm wearing the burgundy palette from Kylie Jenner. So the colors I put on were uh, burgundy and LA. So I have burgundy kind of just on my lids and then in like the corners and crease I threw on LA. So yeah, you're wondering what I put on my eyes. That's what I put on my eyes. Now I'm just going to go in with this Ico eyeliner that we got in the bag and I'm just gonna do some nice little wings. So like, straws on, very nice, um, my wing looks a little jank, I'm like so used to using like, uh, the one I have has like a longer tip to it, so like, it's kind of weird to get used to. But this is like, really pigmented, it's like, real dark. I love it. It's really dark. It's, it goes on like so nice. And I kind of love it. It's so nice using this after I've been using like my semi dried out one for so long. So there we go. That's the eyeliner. I really like it. Um. The only other kind of like felt tip eyeliner that I used was just the Sephora brand. I really don't like these wings, oh my god. Um, I tried guys, I tried, okay. Let's go on to the mascara. So I'm really excited for this actually. I really hope that it's like, I don't know, I hope it's good because I've heard so many good things about it and this is actually like, this is a really good brand. So, let's put on some mascara and see if you beat Clinique. So it's a little clumpy on the tip there, but it will work with it, so. I'll probably do the curl my eyelashes. Hmm. Well, this, I like this, because like it separates all your eyelashes, like, I'm not getting like any clumpy spots right now. Like, usually when I put on mascara, it definitely has like a few spots. Like these are my normal eyelashes and like over here, I have the mascara on and like it really like, it lifts them up and it really darkens them and like it separates each individual eyelash like. They're, they're, like you can't like there's no like clumpy things or anything on this like I really like it I am amazed Enough raving about that. So I'm going to go ahead now and just finish off this uh, Makeup with the color is bay Ooh. I still can't tell if this is like a gloss or a matte finish thing. Like it has some shine when you first apply it, but it looks like it like 
gets mad. I don't know. So, excuse my sloppy application. I don't think this color really goes with my eyeshadow, but I mean, I like it. I like the color. I think it's pretty. Um, this would probably go better with like a nude eyeshadow, but I fail at life, so you know. Whatever. You know, be, be wild, be crazy. So yeah. So yes, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and let me know if you like these kind of um, unboxing kind of things where I like open up my bags and I show you guys a little look using the products because then I'll probably keep doing this next month. So um, yeah, so that's all. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys enjoyed these videos, please subscribe down below and I will see you guys next time. Bye.